outside. What? This, this we were outside. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> we were we were getting our medals. You guys have these medals yet? Yes, I want one. Oh, oh we'll you get you one, Ursula. I like you oh, too, David. Yeah. yeah. Well, I'll tell you what. If you want one, it's our secret location for day four of our medal giveaway, day right? Day four. Not too far, obviously, from where we are. Also, Fiesta Foods. Yeah. Two iconic foods. Chicken on a stick. Corn in a cup. You can only pick one. What's it going to be? Let us know. Speaking of chicken on a stick. This isn't your traditional chicken on a stick. Griselda Munoz is here from Plantology. It tastes like chicken on a stick though, right? Yeah, it does. It has the same juiciness as a regular chicken. Also the same savory flavor and also the same crunch that everyone likes. Uh, but it is vegan. Yeah, of and course. We're gonna give it the old taste test there. That's right, and Fiesta Fashion, you gotta look your best. Adelante Boutique is one of the oldest in town. They're gonna show us a few fun looks. And check out some of these cocktails. Boy, I can wash down my corn in a cup, chicken on a stick with these babies. It is the preparata smurraf ice, and I can't wait to taste Ooh, I'm taking. I'm taking look, this one. They're, they're almost too pretty to Coming drink. Coming up on SA Live. <laughs> Right now on KSET.com, the San Antonio Parks and Recreation Department's urban forestry team has another opportunity for people to get a free tree. It's hosting another tree giveaway on Saturday, April 22nd. This time the crews are going to hand out 1,200 shade or ornamental trees. You can get all the details on our website, KSET.com. Just go over to things to do. And well, let's look at the weather forecast. Uh, 78 degrees today. There's a 20% chance of some light showers. In fact, we're seeing a few of those right now. The heavier showers are just to the south of San Antonio. 81 tomorrow. It's warmer, but still humid. There's a small chance of a storm out west. We bring up rain chances a bit on Thursday out ahead of a cold front. Some showers, a few storms. That front moves through. It does cool us down in a big way for late April, at least. 73 and sunny on Saturday. Ooh, like that weekend. We got stuff to do. Chicken on a stick or the corn in a cup? Uh, chicken on a stick for sure. For sure. I don't know about the vegan stuff. Was that a pepper on the top or a pickle? a jalapeno to look good. Okay, yeah. Top I'm, that I'm thing in. With a jalapeno I'll take on two. Stick. You're ready to go. Here's SA Live. It starts right now. And today at SA Live, Fiesta Inspire dresses from one of the oldest women's boutiques here in San Antonio. Plus, we're making a Fiesta favorite cocktail. How you can make it at home also will tell you where you can find it during Fiesta. And a summer of fun is almost upon us. We're going to check out a theme park with tropical vibes the whole family can enjoy. Celebrate San Antonio. Coming to you live from historic Market Square. This is SA Live. Ooh, boy, if that doesn't just scream Fiesta. All the colors, all the flavors. <laughs> And a little bit of something to, yeah, make it <laughs> love that. So like that is what you use to wash down this, the chicken on a stick, which we are going to be getting to in just a moment. But first of all, happy Tuesday, everybody. Two days until the start of Fiesta, wow, if you can believe. Counting down. And speaking of Fiesta, we're talking those Fiesta foods. I know Ursula said she'd go with chicken on a chicken stick, on a stick, but yeah. you know, corn on, the, corn on the cup is a big favorite too. Mm. I think all year round, corn on a cup, I would pick. Yeah. Fiesta, maybe chicken on yes, a stick. Exactly. So we want to know what you think. We'll see which one has the most votes. Just tag us at SA Live KSA on our Facebook or Twitter page, and we'll see which one's the most popular. Now, speaking of chicken on a stick. Yep. Our first guest today is making Fiesta a little bit healthier and you may not even know it. We're making your favorite Fiesta foods with a vegan spin on them. Yes, and don't get scared of the word vegan, <laughs> right? Because Alta Munoz, owner of Plantology, is here to tell us why it's so good, right? <laughs> well, yeah, it's so good because, you know, you can still get the juiciness. You can still get everything from a real chicken, but mm -hmm. make it plant-based and also gluten-free. Okay, uh, how much longer should I I think this? it should be ready by uh, now. Yeah, right? ready. Okay. Right. Ready. Uh, Ooh, I'll put this, I guess, over. Yeah, just put it over the towel. Right there? Okay. Yeah. There that looks, go. I'm going to let that cool down a little bit before I yeah, dig in. Yeah, so, and we're going to prep another so one. So the breading is probably the secret to any kind of good fried chicken. So of what are we course. doing here? So, so that's a gluten-free flour blend. And okay. then we're using the smoked paprika. 
All right. We're gonna toss uh, some uh, that sodium powder. Are we putting all of everything yeah. in here? Yeah, put all everything. Of everything in there. Don't Just want to make sure. Right. Yeah, okay. don't be shy with the seasonings. And all then right. that's garlic salt and then some black pepper. So we mix it up. And this is the vegan chicken patty. And what's this yes. made out of? That's made out of soy protein. All right. And so that, lots of protein. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's that whole thing is at least 25 grams of protein. Wow. And dip it in a... And an which, egg wash. Yeah, that's plant-based egg as well. Plant-based egg, plant-based milk. Mm-hmm. And last but not least... Crackers and panko. And okay. you said that a lot of people come in and they're thankful because they're having to go gluten free, right? With yes, their diet. Mm -hmm. yes, that's one thing, you know. I guess a lot of people nowadays are wondering more about gluten free foods, you mm -hmm. know, because that's so hard to find here in San Antonio. Yes. And, you know, when we offer something that it's vegan plus gluten free, this is just completeness yes, for them. You it's know? a win win. Yeah, yeah of it looks course. amazing. And now, while that's cooking, <laughs> We're gonna work on this. Mike, you're gonna take okay. a bite? Well, I was gonna say, she said it is juicy, and I don't know if I can break that apart, but I'm gonna take a little nibble on this. I think it's cooled down enough. Mm -hmm. So you said, and this is one of the best things to kind of imitate. Is, yes, is chicken, definitely. Right? So. I'm living through you, Mike. Save me a piece. The full bar hot. It does have, pardon me if you check my mouth, well, the texture of it. Yes. And the seasoning to it as well. And you said you can kind of fake somebody out with this, right? Oh, yes, definitely. A lot of people, a lot of people, I guess a lot of people go for, you know, the crunchy of the uh -huh. chicken. Uh -huh. And then, you know, you need to eat a jalapeno too with it. Oh, you know, it's yes. not chicken on a stick without a jalapeno. Yes, chase it down with that. Yeah. Okay, well, he enjoys that. We're going to start over here with our corn. Yes. Okay, so. just, a little mixture, right? It looks yes, like this is uh, ready, uh, you know, kind of, we toasted the corn a little bit. So, mm -hmm. yeah. So and then we're going to add some mayo. Oh, mayo first. Yeah, yes. plant-based mayo. Okay. All right, so what if somebody was a chicken on a stick, diehard fan, you said try this, how do you convince them once again? Um, I guess I always, I, I never say that it's vegan, you know, because I just want them to taste it, you know, because I feel that a lot, a lot of people think just because it's vegan, it's not gonna taste good. Mm -hmm. uh, but I always say, just taste it, let me know. And you know, most of the time, I wanna say at least 95% of the time people like it. You know, and then they don't feel too guilty afterwards, yeah. you know, because it's like, well, you know, it's better for me. You know, and I'm like, yeah, it's better yeah. for you. You know, you know, this is this doesn't have any cholesterol in it. So, oh, you know, really? it's a win. Yeah. And even now, like we we're talking about the texture, but you can see even the looks of it. I mean, it does look like chicken breast. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. The texture inside mm -hmm. told you it kind of shreds. So it's, it's the same. And I, I like your panko uh, on top. That's nice. That's got a yeah, good Yeah, I love it, so. panko. I love to cook with panko. I guess not everybody, you know, like it because they think that it's only for Asian cuisine. But I mm -hmm. like it for. I, I use it for pretty much everything that is breaded. And and speaking of your other recipes, tell us about those. What else can people find at your restaurant? So restaurants? yeah, you know, if we're speaking about panko, I have some cauliflower wings that we also mm -hmm. bread with panko. Yeah, so done. It's done? Okay. done. Here, I'll put that over there. Got yeah. a new employee over one. here. He's yeah. a side job. Yeah, yeah he's, he's enjoying. <laughs> look, look, he's enjoying yes. breading some chickens. But yeah, like I said, I use pangos, so we have some cauliflower wings. Mm -hmm. We also have a chicken and waffles. You know, we use these what? patties for that. Yes. Yum. And you know, we have a lot of things on our menu. Also, we have tacos, we have burgers. Ooh. We have pretty much a wide extension of, of menu items of comfort foods that a lot of people like. And it's located off 281, right? Yes. Okay. Up there by, uh, what, TPC Parkway? TPC Parkway, yes. 281 okay. Highway and TPC. If somebody wanted to, you know, try something vegan and weren't going to just, you know, dump, jump in the, the deep end all at once, what would be the first thing that you would recommend? Uh, I definitely always uh, tell people to go for something that they already like. You know, pretty much, since I have tacos, I would say I would tell people, go for tacos, you know? Mm -hmm. I have a lot of really good plant-based proteins over there. Mm -hmm. And also go for chicken, you know? So this chicken, we also make it in a burger. We have buffalo a chicken sandwich we have a nashville Ooh. hot chicken what yeah we have I'm intrigued much. i gotta go visit you yeah. okay well thank you so much mike's still eating <laughs> yes please make sure to check them out and we have their information right there on your screen yeah for more information head over to salive.com click on the as seen on sa live tab or just scan a qr code right there at the bottom of your screen so of course we are talking Fiesta and chicken on a stick, and you gotta have a Fiesta medal. So it is time for the big reveal for our SA Live Fiesta medal. All right, it is a place that has been around for hundreds of years. Actually, this area was designated by the King of Spain 
way back when. 105 South Concho Boulevard. Does that ring a bell? <laughs> well, it should. Because I can hear Jen laughing right outside the door. Where are you by chance, Jen? I also have a very loud laugh. But yes, I'm not too far from you. We're back here in historic Market Square. As I even took my, my chicken on a stick, right, with me. Uh, yes, and so for those of you who are coming out here, you have some time. It doesn't start until 2 p.m. We have our amazing Keza employees standing by that are going to help us out to hand out the medals. You'll get a wristband and then you stand in line and at two o'clock, and as you can see, we have some people in line. Say hi. <laughs> yes, so the line has already started, but we, we have plenty, but we do have a limited amount of medals, so keep that in mind. And so you'll want to come out here, get in line, get your wristband. We also have some raffle prizes, so we'll be giving some of those away. Now, some fun facts about Historic Market Square. If you haven't been, it is home to La Familia Cortez restaurants. And talk about, wow, what a perk, right, of the job, because we have La Margarita, we have Mi Tierra, which goes way back, lots of history here in San Antonio. It is home of the original Chili Queens who took over the plaza at night. City Council and Chamber of Commerce created the first market committee in the 1960s, redesigned by nationally recognized architect Boone Powell and Francesco Don Pancho Pisani, opened a store at the market and rented space to other immigrants, including Pete Cortez, who would eventually open Mi Tierra. Now, I've met the family, interviewed them, and the story runs deep. They care so much about their recipes, the food, amazing. I love the tortilla soup, the iconic murals in there, just so much culture. It's such a great place to be, and I have to say I'm very lucky that I get to work here every day. That's a gift as well. So yes, that's a little bit more that you needed to know. We love sharing and loving on the Cortez family because they go way back. Now, we will be sharing more on the Cortez family and their events coming up here at Historic Market Square a little later in the show but don't forget you the metal giveaway starts at 2 p.m. and you have time to get here and again it's a familiar spot so I hope you all will come out get some food have some fun we'll give away some fun things you want to say bye <laughs> back to you Mike well, I love the fact that we already have a bunch of folks out there, and also we've got some little raffle prizes too. So if you want to come out, we're not giving away the medals, like you said, until uh, 2 o'clock, but we've got some really neat stuff that you may win in a raffle prize. All right, thank you very much, Jen. I will be out there to join you a little bit later on. Wednesday Say Live continues with a classic fiesta drink that's been served for years at Niosa. We're going to make a few new versions of this drink and tell you about a new fiesta event that's happening on the St. Mary's Strip. And get Fiesta outfitted at one of the oldest women's boutiques here in San Antonio. Their chic fashion accessories and home decor will give you all the Fiesta vibes. That's next on SA Live. If you are looking to get Fiesta fired or maybe just find that perfect spring outfit, Adelanta Boutique is here to share some of their items, some of their looks, and you know, it's been around 48 years, by the way, so you're doing something right. We are. <laughs> we think, we hope so anyway. Yes, welcome <laughs> Marla. Marla Ross is the owner, and you're here with us today to share a few items, but all year long, you said, it's like Fiesta, really. <laughs> yes, we call Adelante our happy place, and I think it's definitely that for our customers as well, and so, yeah, we're, we're all about color and vibrancy mm -hmm. and you know kind of a global um, representation yes. of clothing shoes jewelry yes well I love color and this is very much San Antonio we have some yes. models so we're gonna start with Lily okay Tell me about her look, it's beautiful. So this is a great travel option. It kind of has an homage to, I see some missions and maybe the Coliseum, but I love the spring colors. Mm -hmm. uh, pinks and electric blues and really bright greens are gonna be very strong this year. And so this is just a great fun way to, you know, say I'm on vacation, I'm having a good, great day. Yes, and the handbag and the jewelry too, wow. Yes, well, so the, the necklace is one of a kind vintage mm -hmm. that's been repurposed by a designer out of Dallas. And so we love just kind of that old world meets, you know, present day mm -hmm. looks. Mm -hmm. um, and we love her handbag, which is a great just kind of spring look. It kind of mixes all those colors together so it's bright and happy. And then look at her happy feet. I know. 
those shoes. Oh, I love them. Pops I mean, of color. Add, add a little disco to your day with some, you know, <laughs> hot pink fuchsia metallic shoes. Beautiful. I love the whole look, Lily. You look great. Thanks, Beautiful. Lily. Beautiful. And now these handbags you brought today, let's talk about those because these are gorgeous. Well, so most of these are from uh, Consuela, which is designed out of Dripping Shrinks, Texas, which is very, very cool. And again, uh, their theme is make today ridiculously awesome. <laughs> and that is very much how their look is. It's ridiculously awesome. So just fun, bright colors, mm -hmm. lots of metallics, but lots of embroidery. Um, these guys over here are really awesome. I love the um, the maracas yes, and they're hand guitar. beaded. And so it just kind of has that great San Antonio flair. Yeah, speaking of San Antonio flair, you can pair that with this next dress. Beautiful. Tell me about our next Well, look. I love this super bright um, maxi dress from Johnny Was. Mm -hmm. And they've mixed in different patchworks of colors. Again, that bright pink, that electric blue, it's very strong. And you can wear this with heels like Kelly is wearing, but you can also wear it with flip flops if you're you know, heading to Niosa and you need yeah. something something <laughs> fabulous yes. and comfortable. Yes. And beautiful. then we love her uh, sterling silver jewelry. This mm -hmm. is a uh, um got a sacred heart on her silver bracelet and then that's a Guadalupe one-of-a-kind vintage necklace from Andrea Barnett who's also a Dallas designer we love okay. our Texas folks yes, yes. represent Texas beautiful yes. I love the look gorgeous thank you so much and if someone walks in and they need help with styling that's what you're there to do we right? have um, we're, we're our our staff is ready for emergency wardrobe mm -hmm. um, updates <laughs> so like you like, got invited to a party and you're like oh my gosh I have nothing to wear what am I gonna do come down our staff will take care of you, okay. head to toe looks. Mm -hmm. You can walk out the door ready to go. Okay, good to know. And our next model looks amazing. We have Sarah. Yes, and Sarah is wearing a just your classic white kind of peasant dr br dress with a multicolored embroidery. And we love her beaded handbag, which again Ooh. is that bright, vibrant. And you can kind of see that that's your geometric design paired back with a fabulous embroidery. And she's got your basic quadratus for Cute. her feet again and comfortable right <laughs> i mean i'm all about comfort so yeah the more comfortable shoes the better yes. for sure especially with all the parades that are going to be happening yes beautiful oh and, and her, her earrings thank you sarah yes her fabulous <laughs> priya earrings and her headdress which is one of a kind out of our store one of our staff members also named sarah hand designs and makes these for us beautiful everything that you need for your outfit you can find it there thank you sarah all right so people where can they find you so they can go do some shopping we are in the heart <laughs> of the Pearl. Okay. Um, we're kind of right on Pearl Parkway. We have bright pink and yellow logos. You, you can't miss us. We're right in the middle. All right. Well, thank you so much. Be sure to go check them out. This is just a sample of what they have there. So many things. Again, open for 48 years. You said your grandmother started the business. Yes, my grandmother started the business. And we do have our Fiesta medals, everybody. So there they are. Uh, yes. That. Yes. You need to get your medals, right? All yes, right. It's got 48 years on it. We're, we're, Exciting. And two more years till your big 50th anniversary. I, it's coming fast. Ah, 50's coming fast. All right. Thank you so much, Marla. Thank you to our models. For more information, head to our website, salive.com. Click the As Seen on SA Live tab or scan the QR code on your screen. Thank you, Marla. Thank you, Jen. Cheers to Fiesta Fun. We share a list of Fiesta events where you can get the classic preparata cocktail and we show you how you can make them at home as well. Plus, show off your new smile during Fiesta this year. Get out there and celebrate without being self-conscious about your smile. How you can get a smile transformation and save money at the same time. Well, your smile isn't just the first thing people notice. It's how you eat your favorite things, help you talk to your favorite people, and keeps you healthy. If you're having trouble with your smile, we know who can help with a single procedure. Dr. Alfonso and Yesenia Menares, the team behind Beautiful Smiles at Stone Ridge Dental. Welcome. Good to see you both. Good to see All right, you. Dr. Menares, tell us about the All On 4 procedure. Who's a candidate? Well, anybody that needs to replace their teeth, and there's millions of patients of people out there that have those teeth that don't last forever. Because of a lot of causes, right? Cavities, gum disease, age, wear, trauma, accident. So basically anyone that needs to replace their teeth is a great candidate for the all four. Even if they heard before that, that they didn't have enough bone and things like that, this technique has given patients hope and another chance to live life with a beautiful set of teeth without problems. And the transformations are amazing. What kind of response do you get from the patient?
patients after their procedures, you say? It's truly amazing to see how they get their confidence back. They're happier, they're smiling all the time. When it's, I always tend to say when it's a lady and they come back for their, their follow-up, they're always wearing red lipstick, wearing makeup, they change their hair. It just brings that confidence back and it's amazing to see them happy and beautiful in, in their new life. And obviously it must make the two of you feel great. And of course, pictures with yes. a thousand words. We've got three of your patients here and just wonderful transformations. Tell us about these. Our first patient, he's a very successful young man. Uh, he speaks a lot in public, so he was very, he didn't like his smile. And as you can see on the before picture, he was letting his mustache grow to cover his teeth. Uh, came to see us, we designed his smile and now he's happier, healthier and he, he's smiling all the time. The second one is an extreme situation of a gentleman that had severely worn teeth in, in, a, in, a, in an over, overbite, you know? So in these cases, like a lot of dentists and patients look at him and like, wow, there's nothing that can be done for this person. But as long as we have a foundation, look, we were able to replace his, his teeth and put him in the right place, kind of like cheating nature a little bit. And uh, he looks amazing, young, happy, and he can eat anything he wants. That's amazing. And the third patient. Now, our last patient, this is, I always say, behind every smile, there's a story. And uh, there, this story is a very special story. You know, when the patients are hiding, suffering, there's always a reason that's gonna make them get the courage and ask for help. And in his case was his daughter was getting married. So he wanted to walk, his daughter walk um, down the aisle and smile and be happy for her. Oh, that's a wonderful so, yes. story. So he was very happy. Well, you call now to take advantage of the Love Your Smile offer at Stone Ridge Dental. It includes a free complete smile consultation. That's a $750 value. You'll get it for free if you're one of the first 10 callers. The number to call is 210-864-9622. And for more information, visit the website ImplantsSanAntonio.com. Good seeing you both. Good seeing you. Thank you. Thanks. Thanks. All right, the line is continuing to grow out here. You have until 2 o'clock, but guess what? We're also giving away some fun swag. We're going to give out the first one. Who's number 5? 005. Oh, look, you get Look what she gets, a mug, a mug. All right, that's, we got more coming up. Thank yeah. you very much. Yeah, you're Thank welcome. You. Oh, I forgot to get oh, a raffle ticket. Hey. How about a cocktail like this for Fiesta? It's not a Fiesta event unless you have a preparata. We are gonna tell you how to make these and some great events where you can get some of those yummy drinks. Oh, and they're pretty too. Welcome back to SA Live. Well, of course, Fiesta kicks off Thursday and there's going to be plenty of drinks to celebrate with. And the Smirnoff Ice Preparata is one of the Fiesta's most iconic beverages. And we have an expert and mixologist with us to show you how to make three different versions of this vibrant, colorful cocktail. Joining us is Brian Gonzalez, mixologist with Smirnoff Ice. Welcome, sir. Thank you. Okay, I'm just doing this right. So, what exactly is this? I never realized this before. So this is chamoy, and chamoy is a Mexican pickled plum paste. It's mm. spicy, it's tangy, it's a little sweet, and it pairs great with a chili powder for a rim, just like you did. We've had chamoy on here. I never knew it was plum paste. Yeah. Okay, so rim the glass, and then what am I putting just yeah, ice so in Yeah, so yeah, do about half the All glass right. filled with ice. All right. And we're gonna make a Smirnoff ice strawberry pineapple preparada. So. Put some pine, some strawberry in there. Pardon me. I'll Just like that. Correct. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Perfect. And a little, a little bit, bit of, of pineapple. pineapple. So where did this drink originate? So the uh, Smirnoff Ice Preparada is actually a variation on the Cerveza Preparada, which is more commonly known as a Michelada. Okay. So in this case, the beer is swapped out for Smirnoff Ice. Is this going and in? the yeah, put put it right and in there. Go, you know what? Do a little bit of chamoy. Just oh. like that. Yeah, you got it. A little Perfect. bit or two, okay. Yeah, and then that'll in. that'll slowly percolate in. Then, little splash of pineapple right there. There you go. Okay. And that'll slowly fall to the bottom. And then we have a beautiful garnish with gummies. It's bright. It's fruity. Okay. And that's absolutely gorgeous. I mean, if you could. And it's fun. If you it's could bright wear this like Fiesta. As Fiesta headgear. 
There you, you know? go. And then you can have a snack throughout the evening, too. So, okay, that, whoops, that uh, goes no, in there. No, perfect, perfect. Put, and put this that guy in there, yeah, that, wherever you think. That goes in there. And the then. The straw goes in. Yep. And then oh, just a, little bit a of lime. squeeze of lime. Okay. And. Perfect. We are cooking with gas yeah. now. And now, one last squirt of chamoy. A little bit more, okay. There you go. Just for posterity, because it is, of course, Fiesta and what do you think? Tastes like Fiesta. It's a lot, it's a lot going on, but it's beautiful and it's tasty. And it's got a little bit of a tang to it too. For sure. Just that, that little bit of mm -hmm to it. So, okay, what's next? Which one? All right, so next we're gonna do our sour green apple. Okay. Smirnoff ice. And this is just on that. Right? Just on that, yeah. Okay. And now another halfway full with ice. Okay. And the beautiful thing about a preparata is you can mix it up any which way you want. The combinations are endless. The possibilities are endless. If you like green apple, put green apple. If you like something a little more spicy, do that. Okay. Um, so now grab another Smirnoff ice, another Smirnoff just like ice. that. Mm -hmm. Pop this in here just like that. Just like that. I do love another doing that with the bottle turned upside down. And like it looks that. cool. And do another uh, squeeze of lime. Okay. Oh, Chamoy too. Lime. Whoops. Chamoy, Chamoy works. Yeah. I'll get, I see, this is why I'm not a bartender. So uh, if you want to do easier. this at, at home and even have a non-alcoholic version of it, what would you uh, replace this with? Um, I'd recommend doing something as simple as Topo Chico. Mm -hmm. If uh, you like a little bit more flavor, I would do something like uh, tonic water. So you get ah. that quinine, a little bit more tang. Okay. Um, and you can even do flavored sparkling water, whatever your favorite flavor is. Oh yeah, like uh, I, I love Waterloo's, things like that. They, which are, exactly. Which are and all the different flavors. Yeah. Up. Okay, what else goes in here? So you want to do some of those uh, cherry bombs, okay. just like that. And then one of my favorite parts is putting the finishing touches. Um, and the finishing touches are some candy right here. Anything you want, just dress Anything it up. Anything you want, make it pretty, make it nice. Let's get that going a little bit more. And your favorite preparata is? Is this next one that All we're right. gonna make right here. This next one is the spicy mango tamarind mm -hmm. Smirnoff ice parapada. All right. So you're gonna take the glass, rim it in chamoy, just like that, do some chili salt, can I steal that ice from you? Oh, sure. There you go. Thank you, sir. And the nice thing about these, since they are not a liquor-based drink, you can get them at the grocery store, too. Or Correct. Or wherever. Correct, right. yeah. So then this one, you're going to start with chamoy in the glass, about an ounce, más o menos. And then the spicy mango tamarind Smirnoff ice right in oh, there. Wow. You will do a little squeeze of lime, just like that. Bam. And then some mango nectar to finish it off. Oh, that looks good. Oh, yeah. All right. And once again, you can get most of all of these ingredients at uh, the grocery store, um, wherever the case may be. You can find all of this. And, and it's got fruit in it, so it's healthy, too. Right? It's healthy. <laughs> there you go. For more information on Smirnoff Ice, head over to SALive.com. Click on the As Seen on SA Live tab. We have provided a link. Or just scan that QR code right there on your screen. OK, and speaking of preparatas, there are a couple of events that uh, you can enjoy these drinks, these festive beverages this time of year. First, we have the Squeezebox inaugural Smirnoff Ice Preparation. Parada Fiesta, the three-part, three-day celebration is going to take place Friday through Sunday at 2806 North St. Mary's. It's going to feature drag performances, live Tejano music, DJ sets by local artists, admission is free and open to ages 21 and up. And perhaps the most common place to get a preparata is at night in Old San Antonio, of course. NIOSA 2023 is going to run, believe it or not, it starts one week from tonight through Friday the 25th through the 28th from 5.30 to 10.30 p.m. nightly. And for more information on NIOSA and all the events involved with Fiesta, just head over to SALive.com and click on the As Seen on SA Live tab and we have provided a link. And don't forget, there are plenty of other Fiesta beverages to enjoy and like at Fiesta de los Reyes this Friday through Sunday, April 30th, here's a look at the band lineup happening right here at Market Square. And get ready to cool off this summer at Inspiration Island. We get a preview before they open on May 5th. It is time to plan your visit to this tropical island paradise. You still have time to come out here. The medal giveaway begins at 2 p.m., but we're continuing with some raffle prizes. All right, we're going to call another number here. Ready? 31. 031. 031. 031. No, we'll 
find another, we'll get another number. All right, she's the one. Coming. Oh, she's coming. All right, you have time to come on out here at 2 o'clock. Megan Dom joining me from La Familia Cortez. Hi, welcome. welcome. Well, a great place to be. It's Fiesta all year long here, right? Yes, yes. 365 days a year meet here. It's Fiesta, but we're extra excited for this week coming up. Yes. So yes, we cookies. Yes, here. we have these cookies baked fresh from our baker probably about 30 minutes ago. So they're baked fresh daily. We got some extra special. Are you trying to steal one already? <laughs> look, look. Yes. Nice uh -huh. try. So extra special Fiesta cookies <laughs> that'll be in our bakery cases. And then, of course, you can't have Fiesta without the margaritas. Mm. Do you mind if I do? Um, these mm -hmm. are from our mariachi bar, but right over here at La Margarita, mm. we'll have a booth outside selling real tequila margaritas. Oh. So you can get real those to go during there Fiesta. Of course, amazing. Yeah. And, and uh, Fiesta de los Reyes kicks off on yes, Friday. Yes, kicks off on Friday, mm -hmm. goes through the 30th. That's, you know, our favorite time of year. It's extra okay. celebratory and fun. Um, and then this year, La Familia Cortez, we're actually the title sponsor of the Battle of Flowers Parade. Wow. So we're very excited for all things That's Fiesta. Awesome, right? That is fantastic. It's <laughs> a great parade. Yes. Yeah, I mean, all the parades are so yeah. fantastic. And the other nice thing, when you're talking about all the events coming, going on down mm -hmm. here, it's just, I mean, it's when a, you have Fiesta here at Market it's Square, it's just a fun atmosphere. Like it. yeah, exactly. I'm like, it's, it's just fun. fun. Everybody, yeah. Everybody's yes. happy. Everybody loves to celebrate. It's fun. A million Everybody's people happy. down here. Everybody dressed up. Everybody just yes. having a, a good time. I love time. seeing all the big hats and the medals yes. and all the clinking. And yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes, the clinking. All right, well, we're going to give away some okay. prizes. Who wants a raffle prize? Yeah. Would you do the honors for I me, will. please? Okay. And what are we giving away? We're giving away a, uh, an SA Live mug right here. It's a nice prize. We have okay. to the last three. Yep. Zero, zero, one. Zero, zero, one. Oh. Zero, zero, one. Over here. Hey. Oh. Uh, and there you go. Thank All you. All right. One more. Okay. We have zero one six. Zero, Sixteen. Zero, zero, six. zero one six. Zero one six. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> one more time. Ah! <laughs> and <It's> right <laughs> enjoy. <laughs> Coffee and or margarita there. I don't know which, but <laughs> should we do another one? What sure. do you think? One more. Okay. Yeah. One more? Okay. Yeah, one more, Megan. Last one. one. We have zero four zero. Zero four zero. Anyone? Zero four zero. Zero four zero. Come on over here. Don't be shy. You gotta run. Woo! <laughs> Let's see. A great zero time. for zero. And, sure. and, again, and again, then you can hide. You know, take that to work with you since you're all dressed up for work. And you know, <laughs> yeah, say it's coffee. Maybe he wasn't supposed to be on camera, Mike. I was <laughs> yes. Exactly. Don't forget, you have uh, the Mel Giveaway starts at 2 p.m. You still have time to get down here. The map's on your screen. 105 South Concho. Obviously, a great time down here. Get you a margarita, maybe a fun festive cookie. Ooh. And we will have those. There's still plenty, a limited amount. Keep that in mind. How's the cookie, Mike? I was going to say, can you dip cookies in the margarita? No. I, don't know. <laughs> I mean, it's worth a try. <laughs> Why not? Right? Mm. <laughs> All right, so be sure to come out here, and we're going to continue having fun and giving out raffle prizes. Yes, indeed. All right. Up next on SA Live, it's an inclusive water park right here in San Antonio. Morgan's Inspiration Island is opening for the season very soon. Everything you need to know when SA Live continues. Island is getting ready to make a big splash this summer. Five splash pads and so much more. It's an inclusive tropical island paradise right here in the heart of San Antonio. And we are out here at the water park with Richard Pretlow, who is the president of Morgan's Wonderland. Did we say aloha out here? Aloha, hello. It all works for us. And happy start of summer. So yes. if somebody's never been out here before, tell them all 
all about everything to cool off here. All right, well, we have a wonderful, ultra accessible, inclusive uh, water park here with five splash pads. Everything you can think of to have fun in the San Antonio heat, we have it right here. Okay, so I see, uh, wow, I see somebody on a surfboard here. Okay, there's our, our ferries out there having a good yes. time. I see a pirate ship and buckets yes. and all that. What's oh, yeah. explain all this? Okay, so <laughs> our bucket is really, really cool. It fills up with water about every 30 minutes or so. And if you really want to get soaked in that San Antonio heat, it'll dump water on you. You can cool off. Uh, we also have our rainbow splash pad right behind us. Uh, that splash pad has heated water for our friends uh, who might have some sensitivity to uh, cooler water, so we have that splash pad specifically for them, and uh, it's just really a great experience. What's new this year? Uh, so what we have new this year, uh, as you can see behind us, we have our ferries. Uh, they'll be uh, entertaining our guests as they come into our park, and just to just to increase the experience there. And of course, uh, we have a couple of new food options. Yeah. Uh, so we'll be introducing uh, some churros, mm. uh, icy as well to help oh. people uh, help people cool off. Oh, That'll be really icy great. In the summertime in a churro <laughs> just doesn't get any better than that. Absolutely, so. and I think the most exciting part is that for the first time we'll be open Mondays uh, throughout the summer. So starting June 19th all the way through August 7th, we'll be open Mondays from 11 a.m. to 6 p.m. right here in this water park. Some of the extended hours, right? Some of the extended hours, yes. It'll actually be our longest season in history. Oh, really? Yes. Wow. And this is a great place, even for folks if they have like little toddlers that just want to kind of be in the water. Absolutely. Not a pool, right? Perfect spot for it. Absolutely. Absolutely. So yes, if you don't want your child to be in a pool, uh, we have the terrific environment for that because it's just a lot of uh, splash and play elements that allow kids to have fun and to be safe as well. Okay, how about tickets? Tickets, all right. Well, you can get your tickets right here at Morgan's Wonderland or you can go to morganswonderland.com. We have a lot of great ticketing options. We have our day ticket option. And of course, we have our season pass that's on sale right now for $45. Gets you a lot of cool options. Uh, gets you into the theme park and the water park. And we do offer special discounts on food and beverage and merchandise. And then for the first time ever, we have our Morgan Summer of Fun Pass that gets you exclusive access into the water park. That's on sale for $35 right now. And that gets you into the water park from Memorial Day to Labor Day. That's one of our brand new ticketing options. $35 and $45? That's yeah. right. Wow. Wow. I know. It's a great value, isn't it? That's a fantastic value. It is, it is. Plus, you got Icy's and Churros. We got Icy's and Churros, exactly. I, I love that. He's buying <laughs> yes. lunch today. Morgan's Inspiration <laughs> Island opens on May 5th here at Morgan's Wonderland. And for tickets and information, call 210-495-5888 or visit the website morganswonderland.com. Richard, thank you very much, sir. Thank you, thank you. Hey, tomorrow on SA Live, how about them boys? A Dallas Cowboy legend is in town celebrating a great rookie year for his signature beer sold only here in Texas. We chat one-on-one -on -one with the one and only Troy Aikman. Plus, nothing puts the fun in Fiesta quite like a funnel cake. And how one local food truck has more than a dozen ways to enjoy it and meet the military veteran behind the business. All that and a whole lot more tomorrow at 1 p.m. right here on SA Live. Celebrate San Antonio with us on YouTube. Yeah, all of your favorite DIY videos, food, drinks, tips, and tricks. If you've seen it here, it's on the SA Live YouTube channel. Just search KSAT SA Live on YouTube and like, subscribe, and ring the bell. All right, it is two of those foods that you just don't really mess with when people love them during Tiesta. Chicken on a stick or corn in a cup. Veronica says, chicken on a stick. Two votes, Valerie, chicken on a stick. Wow, we're gonna have a clean scoop today. Brandy, chicken on a stick? Chicken on a stick is the only correct answer according to Mercedes. I'm sure that a lot of people would have that same answer. And I'd rather have gator sausage on a stick than the above, says Lisa. <laughs> I don't remember gator on a stick out there at Fiesta. Hey, don't forget our latest metal giveaway is right here at Historic Market Square. It is going to begin in, let me see, six minutes, right down here. We have got a whole line of people. Are you ready for your medals? I think they are ready for the medals. I wanna show one thing. And what do people do when they're waiting in line? This young lady right here has been uh, cross, or is this crochet? Crocheting. Crocheting, and can you see this? That is all sugar skulls on there. And then also the other one that she has is, who she had a roll of toilet paper. I just love that. That Those sugar skulls are absolutely fantastic. Hey, two days till Fiesta starts. Viva Fiesta, everybody.